What's up, guys? This is WWE superstar Ricochet, and you yeah. was listening now to Trey Bailey. Like hey, baby, what you want to do? Don't come talking that shit, just drop that shit. I'ma bust that move. Yeah, hey, I'm trying to take that cruise. Fuck all the signs, just you want my man. I'm just trying to speak to you. Hey, tell me what you wanna do and tell me what you like. Tell me where you wanna go as long as I'm your type. You trying to kick it off, texting. Force. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making her way to the ring from San Diego, California, Maya Jack. One of the most dominant women in WWE history. Physically unparalleled in the women's division, Nia Jax has imposed her will on everyone that stepped in the ring as opposition. An incredible pedigree for success for Nia Jax. It's the Queen of Spades! And her opponent, first, from Sioux Falls, South Dakota, Shayna Baszler! She is the real deal. One of the original four horse women of mixed martial arts, a protege of Ronda Rousey, Shayna Baszler thrives on the fear of others. Yeah, it would be a tough point to argue that Shayna Baszler may be the toughest woman to ever step foot in NXT. Now she's as tough as they come. Classic match with Ember Moon and NXT TakeOver New Orleans, where she won the NXT Women's Championship. The sky's the limit. And from Orlando, Florida, Naomi. A big time fatal four-way match coming up here, guys. Which means, believe it or not, we're going to be sending away three of these superstars with a loss here tonight. Charlotte was part of a group called the Four Horsewomen with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? First ever women's Hell in a Cell match against Sasha Banks. An amazing Iron Man match as well. Charlotte has accomplished it all in such a short period of time. One day, she'll be joining her father in the Hall of Fame. With 
these four superstars battling oh, in the ring all at once. We're in for a classic. What a stomp! Good grief! Toss to the outside. Just launched. Looking defenseless right now. She's got to get back in the ring, Michael. You guys see that distance? <laughs> oh, man. Back now inside the ring. Great officiating as the ref noticed she was on the ropes. Floor. Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. What a strike! Right on the mark. She's starting to sweat a bit. She doesn't want the momentum, momentum to snowball. Yeah, but I don't think it's time to be concerned for her yet. She seems to have plenty of fight left in her. Yeah, but I feel pretty confident in saying that she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. Since there are no disqualifications in a fatal four-way match, a superstar has to be aware of the fact that if they're in an elimination fatal four-way match, someone who was eliminated can come back for retribution. She might have Charlotte with the spear! You gotta like her chances now. Momentum is completely in favor of Charlotte now. Natural selection. Victory is on the horizon. Charlotte just changed the momentum of this match. Myron, you touched on something earlier that's worth repeating. If you're a superstar competing in a fatal four-way elimination match and a competitor is eliminated, they can look to settle a score and affect the outcome of the match later. That's always a possibility in a fatal four-way match because of the no disqualification stipulation. Michael, that's what I like to call an occupational hazard. We saw an example of that in 2016 during the fatal four-way elimination match to determine the number one contender for the WWE Championship. The Miz was eliminated from the match, but let's say he had a major influence on the outcome of the contest. Just ask Dean Ambrose. So many things are said about Naomi's athleticism and aerial abilities, but when the superstar locks in her bad place submission, her opponent taps out in the blink of an eye. What a stomp! Good grief! Takes her off her feet. That's how you eliminate somebody's vertical game. We all know how devastating Naomi's rear-view finishing move is, but to see how she's developed the submission maneuver in the excruciating pain her opponents endure, it's no wonder the hold is called a bad place. Naomi's got more moves than you can count, and I think she has a few she can use to finish off an opponent. The bad place submission shows how she's the Look at that in a smell! But can she follow up? You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. We can also see a fatal four-way tag team match, which means 16 supernatural selection. She's in complete control here, guys. The cover. Back inside the ring now. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. Nia Jax is measuring her. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Byron, earlier you brought up the 16 superstar four-way elimination tag team match. It goes without saying that the match is quite the scene before the bell even rings. Something else I'd like to include is that in the fatal four-way tag team elimination format, once a superstar gets eliminated, their tag team partner is eliminated as well. That's right, Michael. Once a superstar is eliminated, their partner is also done for the night. With this much humanity in the ring at one time, it's quite possible that the match will break down into pure chaos. And before you know it, there are bodies literally flying everywhere. And remember, no countouts, no disqualifications. They call it Nia Jax the irresistible force, and she's proven that moniker true as she's overpowered the competition in NXT and WWE. Now you ain't kidding, Cole. In both NXT and WWE, she tears through up-and-coming competitors in just a minute or two. She also turned in some dominating performances against the likes of Bailey, Sasha Banks, Alicia Fox, and Mickey James. We're looking at complete domination here.
the two of you were discussing Nia Jax being irresistible, and I have to agree. You know, I recently invited Nia to my mother's house and offered to make her some apple pie, and technically, she didn't say no. That's not what they mean by irresistible, Saxton. As the irresistible force of WWE, that means she plows through competition. Actions speak louder than words, gentlemen. And here comes Charlotte. She saw it with the spear. It, is that it? Looking at it here. The first ever women's Royal Rumble match was full of amazing moments. But Nia Jax may have had the best performance of and she breaks free. I don't know how she did it. That was impressive. Natural selection. Game, set, match. This one is over. broken up. Well, let's go back to Nia Jax's Royal Rumble performance. When it comes to the unassisted eliminations, she had the most in the Royal Rumble, tied with Michelle McCool. But here's the thing. McCool is a surprise entrant. Four women knew to prepare for Nia, and still fell the irresistible force. Nia Jax set another record that night, as six women needed to team together to eliminate the irresistible force. And it was six of the all-time greats. She counters before it's too late. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. Penny predicament. Oh man, she's rolling now. Gets out of the way of that one. Oh, what impact. Oh, <laughs> is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. Back in the ring again. Oh, and she gets out of the way. You gotta believe this one's over. You're not going to win many matches absorbing punishment like that. We'll see how long she can keep it up. Charlotte is getting... Yeah! He's back in full control now. There's a setup. From behind. Natural selection. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. Now. Oh, and she gets floored by... She just will not give up, Cole. Look at her go! Beautiful technique. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. Charlotte is in trouble. Here we go with Nia Jax. Harsh impact. Good luck stopping Naomi when she's rolling like this. And Naomi manages to reverse out of that one. Beautiful. Back between the ropes. Charlotte turns it around. Nice move. She is on fire. She's turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. And she drops her. That was about as in your face as it gets. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. I think she's trying to pull the point here. Hard landing there. Nothing to worry about. Just a little misstep on her part. Back in from the floor. Nasty impact.
nice move right there. Big cookie by Nia Jax. She better do something fast. Oh, man, she's rolling now. And Corey, she releases the hold. Looks like a questionable decision on paper, but I'm sure she has something up her sleeve here, Cole. Naomi <laughs> just too fast for her. This is not good at all. The pen. She's <laughs> there. She's got her where she wants her. And Shayna Baszler evades that one. She might have it. Damn it. That should do it. Geez, I don't think Naomi's chances in this one. Here we go a second time. This might be it! Oh my! Wow, she's found her way all the way back here. Amazingly, she works her way free. Cole, there may be no beating her. Here. There it is! It is, it's locked in! That's it, that's what she needed. That'll leave you dizzy for quite a while. Look at that, she escapes! Talk about coming up clutch, guys. Look out! There she goes! And Charlotte does what she does best. Beautiful side Russian leg sweep. And Charlotte does what she does best. When she gets in attack mode, look out! Look at this. Nia Jax is letting everyone know exactly how she feels. I don't know if Nia Jax knows where she is right now. Good luck stopping Naomi when she's rolling like this. And no breathing room for Charlotte. Can the Queen come back? What's the Queen got in mind now, Byron? How about natural selection? This match is slipping away from Naomi here. This could be it. Cover. Oh, here we go. There you have it. Your fatal four-way winner. And here's another look at why the Fatal 4-Way is one of the most unpredictable and entertaining matches in WWE. I just love it when the women put on a show like that one. You can see right here the moments that made Maybe this match a great. Charlotte Flair! What a back and forth battle that was. Charlotte's happy with her victory tonight. For good reason, what an impressive win for the Queen. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their feet almost the entire match.